I am so ashamed to have hurt those I love. I am so sorry to have let so many friends down, people who have fought so hard for me. Now at 6, Congressman Mark Souter comes clean. In a political shocker, he confesses to having an affair before suddenly resigning. Good evening to you. I'm Mark Mellinger. And I'm Heather Heron. News Channel 15 was first to show you Souter's very emotional announcement. Tonight, we are learning more about the other woman, quote-unquote, and what is next for the 3rd District. News Channel 15's Janice Allen begins our coverage from the federal building where Congressman Souter dropped the bombshell this morning. Well, Mark, there had been rumors that Congressman Souter was planning to retire, but not many people expected this. Inside his office this morning, he confirmed that he's had an affair and his political career is over. It has been a great honor to fight for the needs, the jobs, and the future of this region where my family has lived for over 160 years. An emotional Mark Souter ended his 16-year career with a political bombshell. He's resigning after having an affair with a co-worker. I sinned against God, my wife, and my family by having a mutual relationship with a part-time member of my staff. A source confirms the woman is named Tracy Jackson, though other details of their relationship aren't clear. Souter avoided taking any questions and even had some tough words for other politicians who have been involved in similar sex scandals. I'm sick of politicians who drag their spouses up in front of the cameras. Souter says his family was willing to be there as he broke the news, but in their absence, he tearfully apologized for what he'd done, saying he was ashamed and that he wished he could have been, quote, a better example. Human beings like me will fail, but our cause is greater than individuals. The news comes two weeks to the date of his May primary win, and the political implication of what it could mean isn't lost on Souter. By stepping aside, my mistake cannot be used as a political football in a partisan attempt to undermine the cause for which I have labored for my entire adult life. And Souter's resignation is effective this Friday. He says he plans to turn it into Speaker Pelosi this week. Reporting live downtown, I'm Janice Allen, News Channel 15.